Happy Lunar Mining Monday, everybody. My name is Vampire Chicken. I'm a grandmaster at the game of Risk, and every Monday we play the April Fool's settings. It all started as a joke, but nobody takes jokes more seriously than I do. And today we are here. We have gathered yet again. <laughs> to play something really silly and really fun at the same time. Uh, these are the bots, white and black. Pink is desperately going to want this. They would hate me if I camped here. The blizzards are always insane. This this time, I mean, no exception. Uh, no, I mean, I want to go here. I mean, Pink's obviously gonna hit me, right? I mean, they're gonna go here or something. I want this camp because I can defend so much of this board. Is there another better one? uh why does a bot i literally don't know what to do i'm actually i'm freaking out right now i literally have no idea where to cap this is so i'm terrified oh my god i mean pink's gonna hate me hate me all you want you're not gonna be the first i am terrified for what's about to happen i think pink still goes here okay i mean hit me bro i whatever okay hit me i mean honestly good game good game it's fine however you want to handle it pink but this is what we are doing man it's lunar mining facility it's True random fixed capitals with two expert bots to start things off. Now, uh, this was a joke. It was all like a big meme for April Fools. And I decided... What? Oh my god, what? <laughs> no shot! Oh my god, I have the entire left side to myself. There are no whites over here. Ooh. What? Absolutely no way. <laughs> the black bot is actually just stuck back here. Oh my god. I haven't even explained what we're doing, but we're doing it. Oh, baby, are we doing it? Oh, baby, are we doing it? Uh, card me? <laughs> love that for me. I love that for me. Um... And my Fortify, we'll leave a two here for Orange to hit, because that's funny. Uh, no, we're going to try to save that. Oh, no, that doesn't go back there. Okay, we're, we're doing this Fortify. This is going to be one of the craziest games you have ever seen. Pink is sandwiched in between me and Orange, both of us human players. Chaz, they said they were going to end me. They want the bonus? Okay, they take a card and chill. I think because Orange capped there, they're not going to slam me. Orange gets to go before black, so the bot shouldn't, if they keep their cap strong enough, they shouldn't get hit by the bot. If they don't, the bot might add here and hit the cap. They're not gonna add to their cap, they must. They must put this back on cap. Courtney Hedges, are you insane? You have to go back on your capital. Okay, they do. <laughs> so Orange is trying to, if they can somehow manage, because of this blizzard, I guess there's some free throw through the bottom. I don't know, man. I don't know, but this is gonna be this is gonna be something wild. Let's see what the bot does. The bot is gonna be forever kill guarded by orange, but on a capital. I was going somewhere. I know I was saying something. I was I can't even remember what I was saying. This is like it just descended into madness immediately. And that's why you do it. And that's why you gotta love Lunar Mining Mondays. Uh I really wasn't sure if I was gonna do it again though, because I said I was going to challenge myself last week, and I was going to play until I won a game on these settings. Because in my April Fool's video, I was joking around and I didn't win. Well, I did win, but it has come to my attention from the comment section, by the way, Doris Shields has the red troops today, that you guys were not content with my victory, because at the end of the game, I did not defeat the bots. So now, I am going to challenge myself. Why are you doing that?! What are you thinking? That's not even a part of your bonus. You don't. There's no need to hit the black bot. <laughs> I'm gonna be playing this again until I defeat not only all the humans but also all of the bots. Now we gotta stay focused because this is getting out of control. That literally. Okay, forget you. I'm taking your cap, bro. Forget you. Forget you, your cap is mine. Yeah, go ahead and blast me. How did you get me out of there? Yeah, hit white bot. So red is gone. Red is gonna bot. Now we're gonna have three bots. I'm getting that red cap for sure, man, for sure. That's my new capital. Yo, you can actually get a bonus from here. Hopefully, or does orange mess with me right away? Probably. Good dice, please. I need this. Let me have a four on cap. What? <laughs> no! 
I wasted my whole turn for that. Pink needs to chill. You need to stop talking to me. <laughs> I need to mute Pink. Come on, no. Now, if Orange comes down for this, <laughs> I mean, they might get hit, but I mean, they might just be too weak. I figured Pink would be too weak to hit me anyway. Red has not bought it out yet. They just had an insane turn. Red's actually close to getting a bonus on the other side, but they have nothing on their capital. Okay, so Pink is heading to the other side. That's that's surprising. They don't want to lose this position because they are kind of trapped sandwich in here. Look at every blizzard. They all make like choke points. Not this one. Don't look at that one. But this creates an epic choke point. So does this. So does this. This creates a honeypot on here. The blizzards seem like they kind of have to go into crazy spots. Not sure about this because I don't know. There's a white bot in there. Is orange going for this cap? Okay, no way though. How are you gonna are you gonna give up this cap? Is pink gonna win this cap? Oh my god. Okay, they're gonna keep this as an eight. And then they're gonna come down. So now I don't have access to going to get that cap anymore. But they get it. I think orange is gonna be able to hold that. And then orange actually might be able to get this bonus. And then at some point this bonus. But this is a bonus I can break. Orange might be able to get this bonus here at some moment. Blackbot is going for this giant engineering bay plus seven down here. So that uh, the the problem, like the bots just get huge on this map. And once the bots are huge, it's it's very difficult to focus on on just attacking the human players. I suppose this is the bonus I can go for. I don't know what Red's gonna do. Red's gonna take this bonus, I guess. Or they might do they might do something unpredictable. There's a white bot here, and white has a bonus. White has the plus four laboratories. Okay, so it's coming down. It's removing a lot of rad. And, oh my god, and now white bot has a plus five storage bay. Okay. <laughs> I could break white bots. I don't know how that behooves me. I can try to get this bonus, but then there's this. Yeah, red is going to go for this bonus. He has bought it out. No, the bot is going for the bonus. Bots are so good at getting bonuses. Yes, you stink. You stink. Okay. I would like to match you, and I would like to get this bonus. Not even yet. We got to go slow, okay? And I'm going to break white bots. I suppose. Okay, I'm going to break white bot, I guess. We're not going for it immediately. We're going to match whatever pink does, and we're going to try to come up here. Pink might get a turn in before me and try to slam. They get, like, a 10 trade. It is fixed. They can get a 10 trade. They can try to slam my cap or something. Like, it, it, this this game could just end immediately. They might slam me, lose everything, and then, like, Orange takes all of the caps in here. Like, something really funny might happen. So, well, I mean, that's not saying much. Something funny will happen. So Pink is also trying to defend against White Bot. Okay, and then they're just keeping giant stacks over here. I don't hate this by pink. It's actually a very interesting and creative way of of doing this. Orange is going to keep this defended. I don't think they're getting this bonus on this turn, but they will remove red from here. I don't so easily kill red unless I get a trade in. Red is only on one card, though, because red's had some difficulties. <laughs> Blackbot is going to come in here. Blackbot needs to be our hero that breaks white. Pink is oopsing the bot. Okay. <laughs> Oops! Your bot, you're making a mistake. The bots never make mistakes. They just play more aggressively than you can ever imagine. The bots always get away with everything on this map. It's really hard to defeat them. The challenge of defeating the bots is nearly impossible. White is going to probably remove me from here. By rolling this out, I obviously made myself weaker. But I wanted to delay white. Oh my god, they're coming towards me and away from pink. <laughs> no, I need this bonus. I need the bonus. Oh my god, okay. It comes off its cap to aggress pink. A beautiful play. Stop! Oh my god. <laughs> Redbot will not leave me alone. Why would it hit the three? Yes! We have defeated Red yet again. <laughs> Red cannot get me out of here, dude. Okay, one on the cap. We are taking a bonus. This is mine. Good dice, please. Yes, a bonus. Yes. I am the first human being to take a bonus. Now, pink might slam me out of there, obviously, but I've taken the plus three drilling plant. Is pink going to come in and try to remove my bonus? Yes, <laughs> I believe that is for me. 
So pink's not going to let me have a bonus because I kept next to them where they wanted to go. Are they going to come hit a three? They might not make it. They might not get it. No, they leave me alone and they focus on this area. So they're going to try to take this bonus, which is hard because you got to get all the way to this too. But they're going for the helium three processing plus seven. It's not so easy. It will require destroying a lot of white. And white does have a bonus. White has a bonus right now. So orange removes the kill guard on me. Okay, they have no interest in kill guarding me. So now pink can actually kill me in certain situations. But uh, orange is actually big and without a trade. Black bot turns in. It might hit white, and then white will probably never get this bonus ever again. Black bot is going to take this giant bonus. Ooh, I actually want this bot to get it because that's going to put pressure on orange. Whenever black bot gets big, that's bad for orange. White being big could be bad for me. Now the bot's going to turn in and clean me out of this or what? Cool. Adds it all here. Okay. <laughs> oh my god. Now this cap opens wide up. So, do we go for do we care about this cap? Not really. I don't think we care about this at all. White is hitting black very hard. This could be bad for us. And it retakes this bonus. Okay. But it is out of the way over there. Okay, dog. Red is down to this position. So I should be able to kill red before pink. Pink is coming for the red kill. If I get to stay... Oh my god. It's only one card, though. Okay, we'll let pink have that. <laughs> we'll let pink just have that. Whatever. What are you, what are you gonna do? What are you gonna do? Let's put four troops here and four troops here. We don't have a trade-in. We usually don't. I'm gonna hit here, but I'm actually going to back away. Because this is a bot. I don't want it to feel the need to put any pressure on here, especially with four cards. So I'm going to back up, kind of turtle up a little bit. Hope that gives me a break from the bot. Pink can now get this card and then turn in. So they make the elimination on red, which I think is very sensible for them. Congratulations to them. They'll be turning in before me. Even with the 10 trade, they really shouldn't hit a 16 cap, but this lunar mining, anything is possible. I think they're going to reach around and they're going to try to get this giant bonus. Yeah, okay, they just are matching. A bunch of 16 caps. So we just have matching. I think everyone's saying, like, yo, we can't hit each other's bonuses or we're all in trouble. And now they're going to, like, over-aggress for this bonus, probably. And then we're going to have to say, no, you're not allowed. And then they're going to slam our cap. And that's how today's game is going to end or what? Okay. So they still need to get up here to get this bonus. They're up to 15 territories. Good for them. And now we'll see what Orange comes up with. Orange is quietly at 49 total troops, and they have not turned in. So, looks like they're going to probably try to take this bonus now. Why would you not? They're going to try to take double bonuses right now. Hmm, okay. No, they just take one bonus, and they're testing me. Okay, this is a test, huh? Uh, Orange has a very difficult time getting to me. I mean, he is here, and he has a trade-in. I wonder if I should sweep Orange out and break him. Because then he kind of has to go through Pink to get to me anyway. Pink has no way of breaking Orange. This is my responsibility if I want to do it. Okay, well, come on. I want to sweep Orange out, dude. I think I will get my card here. I think we're going to go bad to Orange. Because what is he going to do? But this is perfect. Orange gets removed from this side. So if Orange wants to fight with me, okay, they can put a bunch of troops in my face right next to my cap. That's obviously one possibility. Oh my god. Stop. <laughs> For real, white bot? For real? Oh. And white bot has a trade and they have all these bonuses? For real, though? <laughs> Stop it. Okay, we got a lot to do here. We got a lot to do. We got so much to do here. Okay, we are going to go here for starts. But I'm going to break this bot a lot. Okay, so now that eight can roll this way. That's my idea. I'm doing a lot, but I really need to protect myself over here from this bot. I need this bot to roll this way, so I'm opening it all up. Hopefully the eight moves away. That's my idea. I could have broke the bot a little bit more. Didn't really think about it, and I felt like I was doing a lot. So we'll see how this goes down for me. I'm denying Orange the bonus. If he takes this bonus, there's nothing I can do about that. 
Pink turns in and does some something insane. No, matches what orange has. There's a six up here. Looks like they're gonna go try to take all of this. Okay, so everybody over here. So pink will get a bonus. Yeah, they get it. Okay, that is huge for pink. Pink and I are on this side, so I would like to be friendly with them. But I don't know if there are friends on Lunar Mining Facility. Orange is going to hit somebody. He's going to take a cap. Oh, my God. So he gets that cap. So now he just has the headquarters. That's a plus six every turn. So that's incredible for him. <laughs> really, really, really incredible for him. Okay, well done. So black is without a cap but now can be eliminated by any one of us humans. I now am in the worst position overall because I have such a horrible bonus. And I got white stacked on top of me. I think I'm going to die. Okay. Please roll the eight this way. Please don't roll the four. Please, please go this way. Please move the nine. That's what I need. <sighs> okay. It's going to become difficult to take cards here in a moment. Okay. My goodness. So I'm going to try to break this bot. Hopefully a six is enough. I'm going to try to keep my bonus. There's not much I can really do here. So I am going to add this back to my capital. And we'll see if that's the right play. So pink now is going to start getting really, really bag. So there's actually no real reason to mess with orange anymore. But we will we'll see how it goes. It would be nice to get a little more on cap. It would be nice to get a little more control on this left side of the board. But as far as I can tell, you just never get control. That's how these settings work. You never are in control. You just it doesn't matter what you do, you're never in control. It's everything is out of your hands. It's just a random <laughs> these settings are so random. Just whoever gets the lucky roll of the dice like magically wins. There's nothing you can do. It doesn't matter how much skill you have. You just it, you just get toasted on these settings, man. It's just over. But orange is really huge. So my hope is that orange and pink get so huge that they have to fight each other. Because orange is going to start going this way. Taking out all of this. And then pink will probably be coming in here to get this. And maybe they will fight each other instead of poor little me. Now, if we remove all of the bots from the game, then... Uh, you know, I will, uh, I'll have achieved, you know, defeating all of the bots in a game of Lunar Mining, which would be saying something. So this is going to remove white from here. I need to eliminate white. I need to make sure white gets eliminated. Okay, the bot takes out white there, takes the capital. Does it knock out this three? Orange is going to start coming this way, and they're going to be so strong when they get the engineering bay. Hopefully pink does something. I showed my effort to help fight orange. Hopefully I can work with pink to fight them, but I'm not sure at all. Why does pink have an eight here? <laughs> Why do you have an eight here, dude? Okay. So white has a turn in. I have a turn in. I'm going to take this for safety. Okay. 20 should hopefully be fine. This is going to be a, a stack my cap turn, I guess. Okay, so this turn, I'm just putting everything on my, my capital. Just making sure that we got a really strong capital. Because people are getting quite a lot of troops here, and I don't want any funny business. I think it's in Pink's best interest to work with me, but I'm not sure if that's how they feel about it. But Pink is going to come this way, and they're going to be able to get this at some moment. This is a plus four laboratories, and then Orange is going to be able to get all of this at some moment. And then my hope is that those two can... They collide, or maybe they work together collaboratively and easily destroy me. I guess we'll find out soon. Okay. Orange has 93 troops. How much are they going to do? I think they're going to wait until Black has three cards or something, and then they're going to try to kill Black. So for now, they're just chilling. They have quite a lot. If... Black does a lot of damage to white somehow. Maybe I can get the kill on white if white ends on five cards. A couple unlikely events here. It goes up instead of removing this three. Okay. So white is still in here. I'm just happy to try to get random cards in here. White is going to retake all of this stuff, but does not turn in. So white's going to get a turn in. 
And then this is, this is annoying. I need to make sure we don't lose this. I will keep breaking the white bot. I want white bot to be removed from the game. Hopefully a seven is good enough to get a troop here. Cool. I'm gonna be breaking the bot and putting these guys back on the capital. Maybe white will turn it. Maybe we can let white be big because maybe they break pink, but I don't think we want pink to be broken because I think we need pink strong enough to be able to fight against orange if I'm going to have a chance here. And then I'm just going to be like a neutralizing factor that just remains in the game. Let's see if pink does anything huge. Hopefully they take this bonus and then orange feels pressure to come break them. We can only hope. So pink is splitting. It looks like they are going to try to take this bonus. So far, we've done nothing evil to pink. So they have no reason to think that we would. Okay. 21 for orange. For the record, what is pink getting? 16? And what am I getting? Like, not a lot. So let's see if he goes for black now and just massively expands. Because he can one point hold from right here. And I don't think anybody can do anything. Pink even with a card? Maybe. Okay, they're denying black a card here so that maybe black takes a card up here. Interesting play. Black still adds everything down here. So black might not be getting a card. Okay, does it fortify randomly? No. So black just doesn't take a card. White turns in. And they're not aggressing my 22. This is nice. It seems stuck on this 19. Okay, so do I hit that 3 to get a card? Quite possibly. I want to make sure White Bot dies. That's important to me. <laughs> that is very important to me. I have a trade-in on three. That's excellent. Okay, I'm just going to buff you up to like a 25. And I am going to break this bot, you know, of mild expense. But I think it's worth it to make sure that White gets eliminated from this game. Freeing up some opportunities for me to be able to work with pink to defeat orange. It's kind of competitive. Like orange obviously is the, the has the most troops per turn, but if pink and I are getting along, even though pink at some point hated me, if we are getting along, then life should be fine. Maybe orange will break down and hit this 22 one day and lose everything and I sweep in triple cap, <laughs> quadruple cap, super mega attack. Uh, too bad they're not all in a row, or I'd be set up for some insane cap run. Too bad there's this cap here. Because it's almost like at some point if Orange slammed this, I could go steal five capitals, like, immediately <laughs> on a bad roll. But, uh, yeah. Okay, so this is interesting. So Pink now takes this. We were expecting this to happen at some point. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So this might put pressure on Orange to run up here and break Pink. They turn in. They are going to kill black for two, and then they're going to slam into pink. So here's where the game is really going to take shape. Because orange is basically going to get this plus seven at some moment, possibly now, or possibly they're just going to break pink. But then pink really has to address orange, and I'm not there to be able to help. So this should be the kill on black, possibly the take of this bonus. And it's up to pink to get through all of this. I think orange will break. I think he should break. If he's, I think that's that's a good play to try to win. Yeah, so they do break pink. Pink doesn't have a turn in, but they can't. They just can't let this happen. They uh, they keep the kill guard on white as well. Wow. But I don't know. If pink can get through this. Wow. So does orange just win? It does feel like if you get the best position out of the the gate, you do just win. That is how these settings do seem to go. Okay, not much I can do. Okay, I lose three troops. What's new? I go here. Okay, Pink's adding to this cap. How's that gonna help? You gotta, I don't know. I don't know what Pink's gonna do. Orange is gonna get so many troops starting from now and it's fixed, so maybe they just win. Yeah, Pink's defending everywhere. Pink's gonna let it happen. They don't think that they can do anything to orange. I don't know what they can do. There's a 47 down there. Oh my god. That doesn't help. That does not help. Don't. They want me to help slow roll that cap or something? That's not going to help. <laughs> no, don't give up. Please don't give up. It's not over. It's not over. Don't give up. Come on. 
<laughs> Pink just gives up. Orange wins. Okay, so orange just wins. Pink resigns. They give orange that capital. How is that gonna help, man? Come on. Then they go back to that other cap. Well, don't give up that cap to orange. Orange gets 31. So orange just wins. This game's over. The game is over. Oh, man. <laughs> oh, no. Yeah, so of course you take that cap. What are you going to leave there? He has four capitals now. He is going to break pink, right? Leaves a 20. Okay. But pink wants orange to be able to hit me. Maybe this makes sense. Pink wants orange to be able to hit me. I guess that does make sense. Hmm. Should I take this bonus? But then orange can like double attack me and pink gets their wish. Orange is going to keep guarding the kill on white. I'm trying to think of something like genius outside the box. I mean, I don't know what pink wants. Pink wants me to like hit orange, but like I can't. I can't hit orange. There's nothing. There's no way through. I think he's won. I'm scratching my head here. I don't know what. Uh, I don't know what to do. What would they like me to do? What would you have preferred that I do? Hit a twenty cap? That's that doesn't matter. Even if I get it, pink's very mad at me. I mean, what would you? Uh, what would you like that I do, pink? How how could we work collectively to defeat orange? Do you suppose? I'm trying to think of what their vision would be. I mean, I guess I can, I mean, I can get a turn in and come down and slam this and see if pink will do the same thing. I mean, I'll try to play for first if there's some way to, to do it. But I mean, what is, what do they want? If they want me to hit the 20 cap, that just does literally nothing. Hitting the 20 cap, even if I win it, I don't get to break them. I have to get through this other cap to break this guy. But yeah, he's getting 33 now. They're saying good game. Like, yeah, of course it's good game. Like, what? <laughs> what do you want? I mean, orange won. We had to... I don't know what we could have done. You had to have won this earlier so that you could have got into him earlier, I suppose. But I guess he's going to take the kill on white now? Maybe? No. Okay. So white gets to make it to a turn in. I mean, I'm trying to think. I mean, I can come down. I can open up the pink cap and I can slam orange and hope the pink comes off and does this. Now there's a, a horrible amount of white next to me. <laughs> it's so bad. Yeah. Okay. I mean, I can open up the pink cap and see if they're, they're that crazy. Okay. Is pink that crazy? Okay, let's do something. Here we go. I got an idea has come to me. Okay. We'll see if pink wants to do the rest. Let's see if pink wants to get involved or if I just die. Pink is going to go in. Let's go. I think they're going in. Yeah, let's go. We have found a way to defeat this guy. Now, pink is going to be huge. Maybe I should have done a little bit less. But orange is going to lose that cap over there. And now pink is going to be too strong. Maybe I, should, maybe I did too much. I should have done a little bit less. But we'll see how this works out. So now pink is over there. Okay. I should be allowed to have this bonus as a sign of good faith. I should be allowed this bonus over here. Okay, so one of these caps is not going to be defended. I should be allowed this capital now. Now we just somehow need to convince Orange to go hit them. Pink doesn't open this up. Okay, fair enough. But they can defend this all from this side. Okay, is Orange going to turn in and slam my cap? They very well might. I need my cap a little bit stronger. What are they going to do with this? I don't think they're strong enough to break... Pink. Pink has another bonus now, so they're huge. Oh, they're going to take this capital. Okay, so we slow to orange down, so the game goes on. Hmm, yes. They leave just a few on there, so I can't really mess with that too much. And now, Pink, you're so big, you're going to... Oh, they're going to go for this cap as well. 
Orange is gonna try to take all the capitals. Okay. <laughs> oh man. Yeah, Orange is still big. We'll see if he can he can bully Pink out or something. Pink, you're gonna have to come off the 25 and go hit him or something. Yeah. Why didn't you put these on the capital? Just I'm just curious. Why why did you leave that as a one? I'm just a little curious. <laughs> White bot. White is still in here. White is still alive. We have defeated one of the bots. That's half of the goal. Uh, the bot lets Orange hold this bonus. No, it does break. Okay. Cool. And White Bot, you know, over attacks and does whatever. I have 69 troops. I would expect some more dabbing from the audience. Excuse me. Can you can you find people, please, please dab? So that I, I feel cool. Okay, I'm going to keep breaking this bot. Back to business as usual. I take my card here. I stack my cap. These guys hopefully fight from here. That could be going towards the seven cap. It's not a likely roll. It's not likely that you do get this. And orange will be able to break you again, no matter what. Okay. Let's see. Let's see if they go for it. You could have added them here, though, and just gone for the cap. No, they're just going to take a bunch of territory. Okay. Interesting. So they take a bunch of... They take that bonus that obviously orange is going to break. Sure. And they stack on the capital? Sure. Orange should have an easy time breaking and putting enough here on this cap that the 24 can't win. But this is going well. These guys are going to fight each other. So at some point, this 25 is going to come out here. The 25 is going to come get involved. But then Pink might lose this bonus that means so much to them. One day, I could one point hold my silly bonus and this massive pink one. On a really good day. On a really good day, I take over. Okay, orange breaks pink, as one would expect. White bot is... Can we get rid of white bot, please? I hate white bot. <laughs> white bot is not too menacing, though. They haven't added to this 11 in forever, which means I haven't had to add to this 25. I just have to keep hitting it. It might remove pink. My super secret, not quite kill guard on pink. Okay, I'm going to try to hit this three. Pink is trying to alert me to do something, but I'm not inclined. I'm just stacking my cap. Okay, maybe they're about to slam orange, in which case they might be too big. Oh, they're going to open up the 44. Oh, wow. Okay, they're going to break orange's bonus. And they're going to try to win because they have bigger bonus. So I, I actually kind of have to pick the right time to come break pink at some moment. Hmm. Like, at some moment, pink will be much bigger than orange, and orange won't be able to fight back. It's crazy if they break this. Because it opens up the 44 to come clear this out. But they do break. Okay. So they're, they're trying to slow orange down considerably. The burden is all on pink. Pink, you're the one that needs to figure out how to do it all. If you guys could remove white, I could probably kill white at some point and then have, like, a good chance here, but that's fine. White bot is slowly dying. White bot will die eventually. Orange is going to break pink. And then probably this 44 gets a little weaker here. Okay. Very conservatively, he's he's keeping this 12 cap alive. Oh, he fails. Oh, my God. Pink is going to hold so much. Okay. So pink for a turn is really going to take over. Let's see if orange goes for the clean out over here. I don't think so. They're not gonna hit the 24. Pink is gonna be huge. Oh, maybe they will. Okay, maybe they hit that 24 and lose a lot. This could be really bad for orange. No, it gets a decent dice, okay. So he's gonna be able to remove all of that. He's gonna wanna keep it on this capital. I'm not strong enough to take all of this, but I need to keep the balance in mind. I really need to keep the balance in mind. White bot makes it to another trade in. This time I think I'm about to have to hit a really big number that I don't want to hit. So I'm very upset. <laughs> <sighs> okay. Okay, it breaks orange. That's good, maybe, but maybe not. Because I think pink and after pink's turn, I think they're going to be kind of similar in strength. But orange will be hanging on to a plus six. 
Pink always gets to hold the plus seven. I mean, it's all, it's all pretty competitive. Okay, I'm gonna go for this. Put these bad boys exactly here. I think that's a great turn for me. Just keeping my my position tidy, and you guys can keep fighting it out. And hopefully, some mistake opens up the door of opportunity for me. Maybe Pink now is going to try to be nice with Orange and try to defeat me. This would be the most devious thing. Looks like that is happening. They're going for the kill on White. Or that other cap. They want the Orange cap, but they don't break Orange. Interesting. Maybe they're trying to kill White because they left a three. I'm not sure. So they are going for the elimination on White. Right? Or what are they doing? Or they're just taking that bonus. And they're still kill guarding white so that white keeps getting trades and whatever. Okay. Curious. So now pink is very big. I assume orange will break them. They didn't break orange. That's curious. Okay. So they're going to try to be good neighbor with orange and hold a plus seven, plus seven, plus four. I think orange has to break you. Oh, wow. Haha. -ha. <laughs> Get toasted. Okay. So orange is blocked. Orange can take this, and then I get to decide if I break orange or not. <laughs> so orange can take this, and then I guess I get to decide. No, he's not going for that. He actually is strong enough to break pink and go get the capital or no? Just chills there. I want this capital. I think it's for me. White bot, don't get in my way. Stop stacking on me. Stop stacking on me. I'm not going to hit this cap. I'm going to hit, th like, I'm not going to hit any of this. Come on. I'm not going to hit this capital. This capital means nothing. It's trapped in between two capitals. It has no mobility, like literally zero. Okay. Maybe white bot takes the pink cap in some act of hilarity. Uh, so it's not pink's bonus. So I wouldn't be breaking pink to take that capital. Do I take that pink capital? <clears throat> Let's turn these in. Or do I take this capital here? I think that I do. But I want pink to be strong enough to kill orange. Do we let pink have that so that they can fight orange? Yeah, we need pink to be stronger. Orange is too strong. Okay. I want this bonus. Pink is saying victory. I want this bonus. Let's make Orange have to fight both of us. 69 troops, hilarious. We'll see if we can get away with this maneuver. So maybe maybe you're trying to kill White. Why are you, why are you doing this? <laughs> we'll see what Pink wants to do, but we won't mess with them. I think we still need Pink to be strong enough that they can fight Orange. If I had taken this cap, my concern is that then Orange would dominate the game. I want pink to be strong enough, but maybe you got to break the bot this time. Yeah, okay, they break the bot. But we're working with pink now to try to destroy orange. Oh, orange is defending this cap because he thinks I want this bonus. I understand. He thinks I'll want to hit this cap because then I can get the bonus. Okay, orange is going to break me and just get insanely good dice, as you do. Okay, so I'm not allowed that bonus. I understand. But now we can pester orange. We can always put stacks here and pester orange, and maybe he'll blunder something at some point. Did Whitebot just highlight this and then decide not to put troops there? I'm not sure if I've seen that one before. So orange is still the strongest, but not by too much. Okay. I'm going to keep taking this. <laughs> I'm just going to keep taking this. I think that's for me. Yeah, I think this is mine. I think that's mine. Put a little pressure on orange, but okay, whatever. He can just hit my five each turn. It's a very balanced game. It's tricky. It's a very tricky situation. Maybe if I put a smaller number, orange will be nice with me. Maybe orange does want to work to defeat pink with me. Maybe. Maybe they would want to keep this cap open to go into me. Can we kill this white bot? Yes, the bot is going to be defeated. Let's go. We are going to defeat white bot. And then I'm going to get this bonus. And pink better let me have communication bay. Yeah. If I kill white bot, I should be able to take this and hold this. 
Because Pink and I should work together to defeat the other guy. God, his dice are better than mine? I'm kind of jealous. Pink is saying victory. Yeah, he's going to let Pink hold everything. Pink is even just like saying, bro, you're letting me hold everything. Yeah, Orange is just fighting me. Wait, I, I got to make sure Orange isn't just fighting me. Oh, dear. Am I strong enough to kill White Bot? I have a trade in. It's 24 troops, true random. 24 true random troops. There is some splitting. There's a double split. Let's go for it. Hopefully Orange doesn't hit a 55 cap, but who knows what that guy's gonna do. I'm gonna go for this, which is not gonna set me in, but just, it is gonna get rid of the bot, which is one objective of today. Okay. <clears throat> Cool. I just don't think I don't think pink is gonna mess with me. Let's put these let's put these guys. We will go back. We're gonna hide some troops. I think that's completely fine to hide some troops over there so that mentally they're not in anybody's sight. Pink says well played because I left them alone. Pink, we're on take take cards in here. Let's take cards in here. We can we can beat this guy. Take some cards in here. So I think pink will let me hold this. So now I'm getting a plus eight. So life should be good. Let's see if they take a card in here. I've left them in here forever. They're probably just going to take the bonus, but I want them... I don't want... I want to get cards somewhere. Okay. I guess it's fixed. Maybe I don't need cards. But pink is going to let me hold this. They're just going to defend with threes. Okay. So I might be done getting cards here at some moment. Yeah, but pink is going to let me hold this. Cool. So they should trust me. Uh, they're really defending this bone. Ah, that's crazy. Oh, yeah. Because orange is going to have to hit this. So orange, if they want to go into me, they got to hit a cap. But if they want to go into pink, they're going to have to do some very serious damage. Like, they're going to have to hit this 24 and, and then break all of this. And then they might come break me, too. Because they also hate me. They're trying to fight all of us. But this is great. As long as these guys are hitting each other, it's going well for me. He gets such good dice. I never get these dice in true random. He's going to come mess me up, too. Is he going to hit my 18? Come on. Oh, he leaves me alone. Oh, awesome. I get to catch up quite a lot. Let's go. <clears throat> okay, so we are catching up. This is great. I'm trying to signal to Pank that I want to trade there. I don't know if that signal got through. But the rest are going to keep going on this cap, applying pressure. We open up the pink cap in case it wants to go do something insane. And we chill out. 121. We have more troops than pink. Yeah. I'm just signaling, yeah, if they want to trade up there, that's fine. Pink understands. Pink must be a strong player. They understood my little signal, but they're like, I don't want to do that. That's fine. Okay, I'm just saying. I'm just saying. <laughs> I don't have to break your bonus if this is how it goes. They use this stack to break me to go into orange. Sure. Okay. And they're going to stop right there. Orange with the trade-in, can they get through that 29? Okay, it's happening. Because at some point, massively betraying pink and taking this entire bottom could be a winning position for me. So some sort of massive betrayal on pink. <laughs> could be could be huge for me. Could be huge. Orange is laughing. Pink says victory. So orange has 168 troops. We'll see what they do. Pink is going to catch up. But I'm going to leave a giant stack right here, I think. But I'm not going to break Pank. I'm going to threaten to break Pank. Okay. I'm not going to let Orange hold that bonus, I don't suppose. Okay. I'm going to take more bonus here. Do some random stuff. And I will put this here, which is actually like pretty obvious to Pink that I might do something horrible to them at some moment. Orange laughs, because he's never seen two people work together in a game of Risk before. So lucky? Well, no, actually, you were snowballing. And then we worked together to, you know, start to defeat you and whatever. And there's going to be a moment where we can just betray Pink and probably win this game. Because if I could conquer all of this... 
Like, we're going to win. So when these guys hit each other, I'm going to have an opportunity to win this game. Because that's about to slam into 53, isn't it? Yeah, that's going to hurt. Ooh. Okay. God, his dice are amazing. <laughs> he gets the luckiest dice. It's absolutely insane how good his dice are. Hello, visitor. All right, we have a visitor. But Orange Shear doesn't even break into pink. It's very interesting. Very interesting. Very interesting. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Victory, victory. So much victory is going on here. So let's go here. I will take my card here and put these guys back on this capital. See, no reason not to keep a, a big menacing capital over on this side. I could start menacing orange from this side, lulling pink into a, a false sense of security. I've almost caught up to orange, who is continuing to laugh. But orange doesn't have a good way to fight me. They can only go into pink. Okay. They're not breaking that other bonus. So if these guys just keep weakening each other, there's going to be a moment where I can betray pink <laughs> and then try to hold like an extra plus seven and whatever. And there's very little pink will be able to do. I just have to do it at the right moment that then nothing bad can happen to me. It's not yet. The moment is not yet. Yeah. Ah, ha, ha, ha. Okay, interesting. That is funny. <laughs> Pink is full conceding, kind of, sort of, in a way. That is crazy. Maybe I do break one of Pink's bonuses. You can have two plus sevens. Okay. I think I will break one of Pink's bonuses, but not the others. That's friendly enough. Okay. Pink's angry. Okay, I understand. <laughs> but I'm going to let you hold more bonuses. I'm here to win, Pink. I'm obviously here to win. They are shocked. I just took one of your bonuses. If you want to get a card against me, that's fine. If you want to full betray me and try to work with Orange, that's fine. It's just difficult for you to do, I suspect. And if Pink does snap into me, I think I can ruin their game. But that might possibly sink my game. So if Pink comes up and tries to break all the bonuses of mine, I can break all the bonuses of theirs, and then Orange might be right back into this game. It's an interesting balancing act, these settings. So we'll see how Pink decides to play this micro-betrayal. I wouldn't be horrendously upset if they did take a card here. If they want to take a card here, we can do that. We'll both outproduce Orange for a while. So I'm not upset about this at all. Yeah, and I think they're going to snap and go into orange at some moment. 23. Let me make sure I got my numbers right. 23 for orange. What was pink getting? I'm trying to make sure we need to focus. 24. So they're getting just about the same amount. Okay. And then how much do I get? It's very close. It's a it's a very close game. But positionally, I feel like I'm in a in a good spot here. 27 should be enough to sweep this out someday. Maybe not. I'm only getting 18. So I'm actually getting the least. So it, I think it is fair that I do get this. We're going to make you pretty big. We're going to keep adding here to super threaten you. So I am actually getting the least. I will go back off this. Okay. But I have the most troops. And I think pink and orange will hit each other one more time. And that'll seal it. If I betray pink and I break all their bonuses and take everything, I have to expect that the 91 will come stack on me. And so I'd have to have enough troops that I could deal with whatever this, whatever pink is going to slam into me before exiting the game. So I don't think it's time to betray pink yet. I don't think like betraying pink necessarily means that I win the game. Okay. I will break orange. <laughs> I'm going to break orange. Okay. Yeah. I will not be hitting this 45 stack. Ah, uh, is Orange going to give me this bonus? They're going to defend here against my 93. Okay. Maybe I let Orange have that. What do I care? 
I think I'll let Orange have it. I guess. I don't know. Let's see what happens if they hold it. So for one turn, I'm not going to do anything. I'll let Orange hold it for one turn with five cards, see if they actually do anything. If Orange slightly outpaces Pink, maybe Orange will eventually have a stack big enough to hit Pink down here. I think I'm comfortable with Orange having the meme bonus, the launch platforms. If you didn't see the April Fool's video, you'll have to go back and watch. If Pink ever slams this, <laughs> I don't think Pink will. Hmm. You guys didn't realize that these are the most serious settings in the world. The game just balances out. You didn't know these settings could stalemate, did you? But did it stalemate? Or are we? is it a positional slow grind? Is Pink going to slowly amass more troops than me and then do something to me? Hmm. I'm going to continue to not trade in. Add some troops here randomly. It's important that it's kind of a random number. And then I'm going to put these guys on this capital. <clears throat> Okay. Orange is laughing. Daring Pink to hit the 86 cap, which obviously Pink's not going to do. Unless they just snap. I could insist on holding this bonus. This would give me an extra plus four, and then just not breaking Pink. But I suppose we'll just get cards, because this seems to be working. You know, I could put a small stack here, just saying Pink... Don't hit me, and I'm not going to break you, and let's nobody get cards. Hope that that drives everybody crazy, and they all slam into each other. Speaking of crazy, uh, this is being recorded on a weekend, so we got Schrantz kids making lots of noise <laughs> right directly above me. Okay. Probably could have looked at my plus twos there a little bit better. Let's do one of these and put these guys on this other cap. Sure. So if I do think this is going on for too long and Pink has too much, I think I think eventually I'm like, all right, that's mine. And then maybe Pink will go hit Orange? Maybe not. Because I don't have an equitable amount. Pink is getting more than me. Maybe I do it when I, I, I turn in and then I just sit here with everything. And then nobody gets a trade. But I do enjoy that Pink is adding everything over here. And Pink is just going to wait for me to snap and hit orange, which isn't going to happen. Yeah, I'm just going to keep doing the same thing. I think this is the only way. Put these guys back up here. I don't think there's a reason to change anything. And, you know, the longer we wait, the more likely that the Shrutz kids pass on and go do whatever. You know, your your opponents, they might be like, hang on a minute. I know the game is still mated. Let me wait till the commotion in my own house settles down before I take any further action. If anything, my kids right now are helping me. I'm becoming more patient. Because I need I need silence before I can actually think and make a clear decision. Victory, good luck. Yeah, yeah, yeah. All that stuff. All that stuff. Orange, give me this cap. Go put everybody down there. Victory. Yeah, so much victory for us. We're so victorious. I go here. Put these guys on this capital. <laughs> Let me send uh, the adult supervision above a little reminder that Dad's at work right now. I'm at work. It's a very important video. Did you see the opening? Oh my god, hang on. These guys have collapsed on each other. Okay, Pink is dead. Wait, what the heck did they just do? Oh my god. What a psycho. Now they have lost the game. All right, now we just betray Pink and win easily. Yeah, risk is easy. Risk is easy. Do I think I'll be strong enough to fight them both? <laughs> is Orange going to hit me out of frustration? What is Orange going to do? Do I betray Pink slowly or all at once? I think it's all or nothing. If I betray Pink... What are they going to do? <laughs> I don't know. What are they going to do? I can't believe they did that. Doesn't that just lose for them immediately? I can't imagine how they would betray me if I betray them first. So I guess we'll do it. The worst case is they can bring 56 off and mess with me. All right. Well, I got some stuff going on in my own house. 
that I need to to work out. Or I could wait. I could wait one more turn. Wait, we can wait one more turn. We can wait one more turn. We can take this bonus. Okay, we can take this bonus. Hang on, we're gonna wait one more turn. We're not gonna betray pink, not yet. Okay, if you want to hit a 50 stack, knock yourself out, boss. We're not gonna betray pink yet. If they want to slam into this, that's amazing. It's not time for betrayal. They are gonna hit that, no way. That's just a full concession if you hit that. <laughs> that's just a full concession. Okay, let's see if orange stacks on this, as if they're going to go slam into pink. These guys might be desperate at this this time. Bring them all off. You guys can settle this between yourself. Okay. Amazing. Fully amazing. Oh, yeah. Oh, yeah. You guys can settle this one. Yeah. Now's the time, though. Now is so the time for betrayal. Yeah, victory for me, for me. Yeah. Don't worry, I'll kill guard you, Pank. Don't worry, I got your back. You can you can trust me. Yeah, orange laughs. But I'm gonna guard Pank. I'm gonna try to give Pink second place. Yeah, Pink is very shocked. They never saw that move coming. Never in a million years. So I don't think Pink can do anything to me. I will guard them and keep them safe. Let me hit him with one of those. <laughs> Let me hit Pink with a, a little fist bump. I'll keep you alive. Don't worry, you're alive. Don't butt out. Don't worry, you got this. Meanwhile, I'm going to take uh, plus four, plus four, plus five, plus three, plus... That's eh, a lot. Good game. Thank you. I appreciate it. I do hope that you get second place, Pink. Don't quit yet. Don't quit. We got this. Uh, I'm not breaking Orange's bonus here. Because I like that my big stack is open. Uh, Pink is going to try to hit me. Okay. Well, now we should try to kill them. Okay. Now we are shocked because my intention was genuinely to give you second place. Well, you slammed into him. You, I, I thought you were ready for to take second place. But they're going to slam into me. Okay. And it's going to be me versus Orange. Now Orange is going to try being nice to Pank. Interesting. What a what a dynamic change. Am I gonna have enough to destroy Pank? Okay. Guess we'll be taking this. Um so I guess Pink is gonna slam me as hard as they can. Fair enough. Fair enough. Uh so we're gonna do this. Okay. And we'll see how Pink wants to play it from here. <laughs> that should be a deterrent from you slamming into me. And I think I'm strong enough that I defeat both of them now. But we'll see how this goes down. You're going to do some heroic slamming into my stack and maybe Orange can come break me situation? They do open me up, so we can just kill Pank. Okay, so we can kill Pank. And Orange cannot... I was gonna oh, I was gonna hold this kill guard and give them second. Okay, orange loses a hundred troops. And forty-six. Okay, so we have to kill pink. Cause I was genuinely gonna give you second, of course. Pink thinks this is victorious. I think I still win quite easily, to be honest. I think. Unless I'm gravely mistaken. I think I win quite easily. There's a lot of can I cap run? <laughs> the funniest is to just cap run. Wait, there's nothing on the caps. There's nothing on the capitals. There's four open capitals. There's four open capitals. I, I, guy, there's four open capitals? Okay, he defends one of them. Okay, so we have to kill Pank. Okay, so we have to kill Pank and then try to cap run, I guess. Um, okay. Please don't true random me here. Suppose we ought to take this one first to make sure we get it. Yeah, get toasted. <clears throat> Genuinely wanted to give you second place. Sorry you didn't feel the same. Uh, let's turn in. And now 64 can go over here. We can one point hold. Wait, I've actually done this kind of dumbly. 
Because I should be trying to, I guess, eliminate a bunch from here. Do I have enough to actually do this? Oh, wow, I did that right. Uh, and that, should I defend this capital? I suppose. They have three cards. Okay. So we'll defend this capital, and then we're going to try to one-point hold from here. Let's see how much damage they can do. They're getting 24 now. If we can set up a one-point hold here, we win the game. So let's see how much damage they can do. I get to turn in, and I have a 44 that I can add to whatever stack. So as long as we can clear out whatever they do here, and I'm not sure that we can. If they leave random troops everywhere, then maybe it will be tough. But if they fully retreat to the capital, maybe it's it's quite simple. Okay. Are they going to go all the way down to break this bonus? They should, I guess, but they're not going to. Ah, they're going to break this one as well. They're splitting a bunch, which is going to make this complicated. I, I don't have a very good trade. Okay, so we're going to have to... We're, oh, yeah, pretty well done. Okay, okay, okay. Then this comes out. Okay, that's not scary at all. Now my 89 can actually come back to help me defend something. Okay, so I guess we'll see how much of this we can get rid of. And then we'll we'll try to get a, a one-point hold on more board than they have. Don't ask me where that one-point hold is. I guess I do see it, though. Okay, that should be fine. That should be fine. We can do it from right here. We can have some turn in. I'll be able to hold this bottom stuff. I don't know. I think I'd rather just have a bunch out here. Like a bunch. So that literally no matter which way he goes, I have a bunch to hit him back. I'm still ahead in troops. He's out he's outdoing me for now. He can come down and break a lot of this stuff. But the 70 should be able to undo it one point hold, and then we win the game. This should be the end. Okay. Because no matter what he does here, he needs the 80 needs to be somewhere else. But he can't allow me to cap run. If he brings like all the 80 somewhere, we might be able to cap run at some moment. In a glorious, hilarious sort of way. Okay. So we're still way up on troops. And he's just putting them on the cap. That's no sweat. Okay, he's not activating the troops. Perfect. I don't know where he's supposed to put them, but like, I don't know, down here or something? But then I'm, I'm obviously going to hit him. So let's see if we can undo all of this in one point hold and win the game. It would look a little bit something like this. Bam, bam, clear all of this stuff back out. And then one point hold all of this. <laughs> a two point hold, sorry. One is a cap though. So now we're two point holding this gigantic, look, I'm not going to count it up. You can do the math in your own heads if you want to calculate that. And now we can just switch back and forth. We do have access to one more card. He has not bought it out. Oh my god, how did they get that? So now they can... Okay, they shouldn't be able to break, but, you know... Their dice have been so good the whole game, so they will break this. No, not this time. So they can put more on this capital now. Sure thing. They're going to put 36 down there. I get so much more than them. It's not even fair how much more I get. So I'm going to go here... I mean, honestly, I could just probably put this whole 44 somewhere. So let's put that down there. So I'm no longer defending the cap. They have five of six caps. They're getting 30 and I'm getting 43. So we are massively outproducing them. So unless we just get a, a horrible roll here, we're going to win the game. I get more than you. I get way more than you. And I have a trade-in that you don't even know about. So we're going to spend a little bit of time just out-generating them. They have to come to me. I'm not going to you. They were they wasted one turn hoping that I would hit one of these and then they'd be able to slam me. But I'm not coming to you. I'm taking my time. I'm going to win this game. I am going to win the Lunar Mining Challenge and nobody can take that away from me. I'm going to defeat all of the humans and all of the bots. And I, I have a secret trade in you don't even know about. You'll learn about it one day. I'm going to pull literally every single troop out. This will be big enough to eventually take this. At which point, I guess we can go here. I just have to be worried that the 90 can pull off to this side. I'm going to wait several turns because, I mean, I'm just I'm massively outproducing you. So there's no reason not to be patient here. Just slowly bringing... I'm going to bring every single last one. You're only getting 30. The game is over. I'm getting 15 more than you. 
So you have to try, you got to try something. You got to put a stack next to one of my stacks and hope that I lose. Otherwise, you're just waiting for the, the inevitable. I am going to, I'm, I'm going to be patient. I am not going to throw this game. <laughs> I mean, get frustrated at home all you want. This is the only way to do it. Okay, this is close to being able to take this capital. Okay. Maybe I keep all the pressure on one point. All right, he's going to dare me to hit this. I should be able to get it. Okay. Yeah. Okay. Because I also have a turn it. This is, come on. We got to have this now. This should be 100%. So, well, it's true random. This should be a win, though. Cap run. Aha. Uh -huh. Yeah. I just need one more capital. Uh, you guys are all going to go here. And now they're getting 10 troops per turn. They can try putting this next to me, but then I can cap run from the back. Actually, wait. Yeah, I didn't need to put... Wait, why did I put them all here? Okay, I maybe could have just taken this bonus. So now we cap run. How much do they leave? We obviously have enough to put on this cap. If I don't have enough to hit this, I'll just take this last bonus and stack this cap. So I don't think I have enough yet. So we are going to be very cautious. We're going to do one of these. We're going to take the meme bonus. Yes, it is mine. Finally. And now we're just going to stack here until we're able to cap run. Or we can stack here as if we're going to go through the rest of uh, yellow hair. So we are going to win this game. Let's go. That's the bot. There we go. We, we got them to quit the game. <laughs> so now it's just only a matter of time. Let's go. That, that lets us do an easy cap run. We'll do it. Uh, we'll just do it right from here. The most efficient way. Not going to world dom. You know what? Forget you. You're going to bot out. Okay, you know what? Get yourself world dumb to see if I care, you noobs. Yes! Orange got off to an amazing start. At some moment there, we did betray Pink in order to win the game. But I was genuinely going to give Pink second place. I don't think that they saw it that way. I think Pink is a strong enough player that they were able to work with me to fight Orange for quite a while. So, you know, sorry about the betrayal and whatever. But I didn't think you were a beginner. I thought you were expert plus, maybe a master level player. This was a bunch of beginners and novices, which is crazy because these guys actually played really well. And if you want to play really well, make sure you're subscribed to the channel because we'll have to come up with some new challenge for next Monday. See ya.